Prime Minister James Marape in Parliament on September 7, 2021, directed an inquest into the death of late Rex and seven others who believed to have died from an anesthetic drug called Propofol after undergoing surgery at the Port Mosby General Hospital. He also promised to present the full report in Parliament and make findings known to the Wanzing family and the public. Five months since the death of the 14-year-old on August 12, 2021, the report is yet to be made public. The family of the late teen this week expressed frustration at the government, requesting for the release of the long-awaited report. It's been very frustrating for us to be dragged along. Like we're like in total darkness. We don't. Ministers are not coming, especially the health minister is not coming up with good answers to us. Why are they holding on to the report so long? We just want the report to be released to seek justice for our son. In a text message to mother of late Rex, Raela Wanzing, Health Secretary Dr. Osborne Liko said the health department had completed and submitted the report to the government on January 18, 2022. If the report has been done, then why are they taking so long to release the report? Dr. Liko said government advisers are assessing the report and will provide advice and instruction to the health department regarding recommendations made in the report. Jumai Masukba, TV1 News.